today when people borrow from the bank, the bank should hold some reserve in order to be able to face some crisis if the credits are not paid back. So the debate uh, today is about uh, if there's uh, what we call those capital requirements, if they should be uh, increased or decreased, if the credit is favorable or if it's penalizing the transition. So that's those uh, two factors. There's the first one, which is for green activities which make the, the green credits more profitable for the bank or um, the, the other factor, which is the penalizing factor for activities that are harmful for the transition, uh, which makes the credits um, more costly for the bank. Uh, but our study is not about this debate um, regarding if the credits are more risky or not, but we really do the a simulation if those uh, instruments were implemented and uh, what would be the impact regarding, of course, the financing of the transition and of the project, but also on bank profitability. And uh, we also look at the impact on the global uh, credit growth or credit contraction. So we did two simulations, uh, the first one on the supporting factor and the other one on the penalizing factor. What we found on the supporting factor is that the impact is very limited and is not strong enough uh, to uh, stimulate new green projects. For example, if you buy an electric car, it's much more interesting to wait for the price to decrease of the car or to uh, use the public subsidies. And for the penalizing factor, here there is uh, much more hypothesis because you can use a, a different uh, calibration uh, or you can use different uh, parameters from a small one to a much uh, bigger one. Uh, but you can really have an impact with this, um, this uh, instrument but it, the calibration must be important. But if the parameter is too wide, for example, if it includes all the fossil fuel uh, energies, or if it includes all the harmful activities uh, as the car, uh, car industries or the aeronautics, then there is secondary effects. Uh, there is a contraction of all the credits, and not only on the targeted credits, but also on the rest of the economy, as the bank cannot do as uh, many loans as it uses to do. Regarding the impact, the penalizing factor can be really interesting, but as uh, its impact can, can be too important, uh, this instrument should really be limited to uh, certain uh, fossil fuel energies that have a clear exit plan, such as uh, coal. But to have a more global impact on the whole uh, transition, it's worth exploring other options, such as a supervision mechanism from Pillar 2, as the, the net zero objective for banks and transition plans.